Hi guys, uh, welcome back to new tutorial of uh, Jetson Nano RP LiDAR interface for ROS2 Humble version. So in previous video we seen how to install the Humble version in Ubuntu 20.04 using ISO cross documentation is an infocal. So it is unsupported for the Humble right. So the Gemini only Gemini only the supported version for ROS2. So using that ISO ROS documentation we install the uh, humble version in 20.04 focal so well in this video uh, we are going to see how to interface an uh, rp lada sensor uh, with an uh, jetson nano and then uh, uh, we'll start with an uh, mapping using a different mapping approach like uh, slam and cartographer and also the lower controller using a micro ROS. so uh, first i'm going to connect the uh, lidar with my jetson so after connecting a ladder, I am going to open a new terminal and then type uh, open a new directory using a directory command mkdir rp ladder. Then make src folder mkdir mkdir src. Okay. Now, now go to the browser. I, I give the this description in my. Uh, I give the link in my description. Follow, follow that for uh, RP LiDAR uh, directory and the package thing. So this is a directory for RP LiDAR interface. So the repo, uh, you can uh, download the drivers for your RP LiDAR thing. So open uh, terminal and get. Clone. Okay, now we clone the RP letter package into the SSC folder. Now give cd dot dot make cow cold kin make cold kin build. Okay, so it will take some time. So after uh, connecting the RP LiDAR, uh, we'll get the scan topic right. So this is an one of the information needed to make the mapping approaches in SLAM, Toolbox and the Cartographer and the Vodometry and the TF is needed to make those things. So after uh, building successfully, uh, we'll uh, start with the mapping and then a lower controller using a micro ROS using ESP32 or an Arduino Nano thing. So then. Uh, I uh, will make uh, some small AMR using uh, this Jetson and uh, Micro ROS ESP32 or an Arduino Nano and with a LiDAR sensor with webcam for Arco marketing in ROS2 version. So it's a uh, long series of video. You will learn ROS2 Humble like hardware acceleration. So these many things we will learn from that. So it will take some time. And then uh, we'll source the timer before uh, finishing that uh, building process. Source opt uh, ros humble setup dot bash. So then uh, we type ROS2 topic. So 80% is finished. Next. Assembly is working on our system. There is no issue with us. 
so now the cloning process is over so source install setup.bash so go inside the src folder type ls go inside the rpleader directory and go to the launch file so now type ros2 launch rpleader launch talk by Get uh, now. So, some technical issues going on. So, once again, we'll relaunch. Okay, now we launch this as well with our pillar. So, type cross to topic. So we'll get a scan data I think, uh, we'll see the output in the terminal. So the applet is working now, so far fine tune that, type ROS2 topic, echo scan. Okay, we'll get the output in uh, these values. Okay, for uh, finalize that, we need to open our base. So for that, we need to close this thing. Type ls, and you can find out that view underscore rpleader dot launch. So type ros2 launch and view underscore rpleader dot launch dot pi so uh, this thing will launch the rpladar uh, output with an rvis so we can visualize the rpladar output in the rvis thing so we need to unplug once again and replug the jetson see that the output is now slice here so I'm close to the RP ladder so the scan value is changing right so for finalize that we can increase the size of these things okay so the output we get in uh, R is and then uh, uh, we need to make some odometry information that like fake water and tf static information to make the mapping approaches so then uh, next video we'll see how to interface and micro ROS agent with an jetson and we'll move the robot from on to uh, another location using utility operation mode by cmd well subscription model so thank you we'll see in next video how to use the hako mocker though those are the series of videos available now so it's going to hit the sky. Thank you.